At the start of Football Manager 2024, you will find Stefan Bajetic at Liverpool. He will be a member of their under-21 squad. At the age of 18, he is yet to be capped by Spain's international teams. He is valued by Liverpool at £18 million to £54 million. He has a contract worth £8,000 per week and that will run until 2027. Looking at the positions on the pitch that he can play, he can play as a centre-back, a defensive midfielder, or an orthodox central midfielder and can even play as a makeshift right back or right wing back. Looking at his attributes, his game is built in the physicals around his stamina, pace, balance, acceleration and agility. In the mentals, he has good aggression, anticipation, composure, concentration, decisions, positioning, teamwork and work rate. And in the technicals, the first touch, Marking, passing, tackling and technique are all standouts. Now he has already broken into Liverpool's first team, so we know a bit about his game. But he comes with one player trait and that is to bring the ball out of defence. So, he's already a Liverpool player. Will he break into the first team in game? And how quickly will he develop as we move to 2028? So we have now jumped five years into the future. It is 2028 and we find Stefan Bajatic still at Liverpool. He is now part of their first team. He's 23 years old and has played four times for Spain's national team. He's worth 51 to £153 million and has a contract worth £165,000 per week and that will run till 2033. Looking at the player's attributes, he has now started to massive development in terms of being being a player in the physicals, acceleration, agility, pace all standing out. In the mentors, he's now really well rounded with anticipation of 16, composure of 15, concentration of 15, decisions of 15, and determination of 15. He also has positioning, teamwork, vision, and work rate score highly. In the technicals, first touch of 16, tackling of 16, marking of 15. Passing of 15, technique of 14. If we look at his playing path to see how he has got to this point. So he actually went out on loan from Liverpool to Preston. In the first season, he played 15 times whilst on loan at Deepdale. He then went back to Liverpool where he made two Premier League appearances. He then went out on loan to Sheffield United and Notts Forest, gaining game time in the Championship. And then in the 26-27 season, he went back to Liverpool where he would play 23 times in the Premier League. And finally, in the 27-28 season, he would break through playing 35 league games, scoring one goal and having four assists. So his career is definitely on the upward curve. He's now started to develop as a midfielder. The big question is, will he stick it out at Liverpool or will he move on? Will he get the game time that he needs? How will he develop in five years' time? Let's jump five years further forward to see exactly how he's getting on. So it is now 2033, we have moved five years forwards and Stefan Bajatic is still at Liverpool. He is now 28 years old, has played for the Spanish national team 55 times and is valued at 103 to £310 million. He has a contract worth £275,000 per week and that runs until 2036. Looking at the player, he has developed significantly by the age of 28 and he's probably now at the peak of his powers, his media description is an elite midfielder. Looking at the physicals, he still scores highly in the acceleration and agility, but all the rest of the physicals are brilliant too. In the mentors, 16 for anticipation, composure, concentration, 15 positioning and 15 for vision. And then in the technicals, 16 for first touch, 16 for marking, 15 passing, 15 for tackling. If we look at his history to see how much first team football he has got at Liverpool, so after those loan moves and going back and breaking into the first team he has continued to be a first team player playing more and more as the seasons have gone on and in the 32-33 campaign he actually was an ever-present playing every single Premier League game now his goals aren't really his game but in terms of his assists he has a four a five a three but the baffling thing is even though he's developed completely it seems his average ratings aren't matching what his development shows and his actual highest average rating is a 6.96 .6. so will Stefan Bajatic just see his career at Liverpool 
five years further down the line, will he have decided to have made a move? Let's see what happens and go five years further into the career and see where we are in 2038. So it is now 2038, we have jumped five years further forward and we find Stefan Bajatic is still at Liverpool. Now at the age of 33, he has played 87 times for Spain. He's valued at 5.8 to 17.5 million pounds and he makes an eye-watering 425,000 pounds per week and has a contract that runs to 2039. Looking at the player, even though he's starting to come towards the end of his career now, he still retains all of the abilities that he had five years previously and probably will still keep them as he moves towards the end of his career if we look at what has happened in his career and how he has stayed at Liverpool so he has been an ever-present most of the seasons one season playing 10 less games than the others but when we look at it he has finally started to improve those average ratings as he gets into the latter parts of his career finally breaking into a 7.01 7.09 and a 7.03 average rating in terms of the goals obviously still playing further back in the midfield isn't really where he's judged upon and he does have some assists also if we look at his entire playing career then 487 games eight goals 42 assists nine player of the match awards and a 6.93 average rating is probably a little bit poor for the player that he has become if we look at the milestones to see what he has achieved whilst he has been at Liverpool going all the way back into the 2023 season so made his first under 21 international appearance for Spain against Turkey he was a Europa League runner-up FA Cup winner Olympic Games third place he then was Skybet Championship champion with Nottingham Forest getting promoted Liverpool then won the Carabao Cup the Premier League he got his first international cap at the age of 23 Carabao Cup winners again FA Cup winners another Carabao Cup placed third in the Nations League Premier League champion in 2034, FIFA World Cup winner in 2034 and a Community Shield, uh, Carabao Cup winner in 2035, Champions League winner and Super Cup winner in 2035, then 36, Carabao Cup, FA Cup, European Championship winner with Spain in 2037, Champions League runner-up, UEFA Nations League winner, FIFA Club World Cup winner and Premier League champion and Champions League winner in the 2038 season. So, Stefan Bajatic has had himself an absolute insane career, winning so many things with Liverpool and developing into the player that real-life Liverpool really want him to become. I think he's fantastic in the game, probably not going to be able to afford to buy him unless you are one of the superpowers in world football, but what a player Stefan Bajatic has become and what a career he has had at Liverpool. Right then, if you're still with me at this point of the video, firstly, a big thank you. Secondly, if you could hit the like button and subscribe to the channel, I really would appreciate it. I cannot thank you all enough for the support you've been giving the channel across the past couple of months. I really, really have been overwhelmed by the support that I have been given. Before you go, don't forget there are other things on the channel, hints, tips, tutorials, wonder kids, let's plays, a little bit of something for everybody on the channel. But for this one, I'm going to leave it there. Big thank you for watching. I'll see you on another video very soon.